Good day everybody, it's Jerry from Backcountry Ranch and welcome to today's video. Today's video, I developed something by listening to you guys, the viewers, and I made this incredible, easy fire starter. Because you guys know, in previous videos, for the life of me, I could not get a fire started with these rods. It was impossible mission. But I took all your advice, like I said, and I'll show you what I came up with. So it's really a mixture of stuff. We're gonna mix some steel wool, grade 000. I got some dryer lint. I picked up these from Princess Auto, real tree edge fire starters. These will not light on themselves. And of course, we got this Tinder Maker Smith that I picked up from Cabela's is the final ingredient. We're gonna mix them all together. And this stuff works incredibly well got some steel wool steel wool by itself will not burn it'll kind of like melt i don't know kind of like you'll see steel wool by itself does that not enough on its own to start a fire unfortunately Second ingredient is dryer lint. Dryer lint will start a fire, but won't last for long. See, even by itself, it's being really stubborn right now. Really stubborn. won't go then we got this stuff out of the package it's like a big brick I was gonna break some pieces off there big chunk just to show you that by itself it won't go either No go, no go. So I do, picked up this from Amazon, right? We're gonna make a bunch. So get my steel wool. We're gonna break it apart in chunks. Steel wool is going to be the binder. We're gonna stick some dryer lint in there, All right? We got this stuff right here. This I'm gonna be called the accelerant since it won't burn by itself. And then lastly, we're gonna use this tinder maker Just basically, we're just shaving off the wood. Just like that. We're gonna throw that in there too, okay? So now we got our magic potion and we start Crush everything up and work everything together. We're crushing what I call the accelerant into the steel wool, the dryer lint, and the wood. I just keep folding it, keep working it together. That's how we roll. And you don't have to go too crazy with it either. So I just did a little bit. I'm gonna pull some off. 
with my fingers. We're gonna throw it right down there. Look at that. See how easy that was? Look at it burn. The accelerant keeps it burning for a while. So you can get your fire started. Look at that. Look at it burn. You see what I'm talking about now? Just let that burn, let it burn. And it's still burning. Now if you can't get your fire going with that, for the amount of time it's burning, well you got some serious issues. Serious issues. All right, shut her down. Shut her completely down. And then I picked up these little containers, waterproof, airproof. These are off Amazon. And I take my mixture and I'm starting to pack it in there. And we start the process over again and fill one of these tins up. So you can see right here in the container, basically the steel wool is the binder that keeps everything together. The dryer lint is fuel, the wood is fuel, the real tree fire starter is the accelerant. In my opinion, it works extremely well, as you guys can see. And I just stick it in my little tubes here, just like that. They're definitely not going to be able to read. So basically, with these real trees, fire starter, light any fire fast. 30 year shelf life, 100% waterproof, safe cooking, burns for up to 10 minutes at over 750 degrees. So what's inside of the package takes a little bit to get going. That's why it's recommended to use these properly for their purpose is that you light the package. You'll light the corner of this package and it would get going and it would burn. But I can break one of these packages down. One of these packages mixed with everything else will equal everything that I stored in this pouch, which I could probably start like five to seven fires, which is in each one of these containers that I'm gonna take with me in the woods. We got some real life situation here. Wolves nipping at my heels. I fell in the water. It's freezing cold outside. And I'm gonna try to get a fire going. Take my waterproof tin. Dab of my magic elixir right there that I got on the paper. Look at that, eh? Lights up so quick. It's 
throw my little kindling on there that I cut up with my beaver craft knife. Let's get this party going. Finally picked up some steam. Campfire beer. Red truck brewing. Happy pills. Just piled on a bunch of wood. Gotta wait to get started. Replenished my firewood for the winter time because it's gonna be a good seven months before it gets nice out again. Winter is coming. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my video of my fire starter hack. It works amazing as you guys seen. So if you have any questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.